it's me, yeah girl, Shaky B, and this is Hands-On Activity. Let me just give y'all a little brief synopsis on Hands-On Activity with Shaky B. I'll be doing things in life and traveling and fun and everything under the sun on this series. I thought, why not start off Hands-On Activity with me being a new mom? So the secret is out. I am getting a puppy five more days and I will have my little love bug in my life, in my home, sharing my space with me. And I could not be more excited about that. With that being said, the first video that I'm going to give you guys is a puppy haul. In any case, when you're planning to get a puppy, you're going to start buying stuff. And I did that. I personally don't think I overdid it, but you know, there's a lot of stuff and he's not here yet. So I'll go through all the things that I got that made me feel like I was going to be ready, as well as the things that I plan to get once I pick him up on Thursday. So let's get straight into it. So we can start with the stuff that is on the ground here. This little back pillow, purchased for myself so I can sit on the ground with my puppy a lot. I got back problems, I don't know about y'all, but I do. And yes, I wanna be able to sit on the ground and be comfortable with him while he's still little because he is going to get big. I am not getting a small dog, guys. I'm getting a big dog. And we'll talk about what kind of dog that is later on. But so yes, I have to give me a back pillow. Um, and then this is his bed, his living room bed. He has two of them. Um, so yeah, when he gets bigger, I didn't want to get anything small, too small, that when he gets bigger, he can't use it. So I had to make sure I got him a big enough bed. And it goes with my, um, house if you've seen my couch before it's the same color and thought it was really cute it's like memory foam feels really soft i got it from tj maxx slash home good next thing is this cute little toy box freaking love it i also got this from tj maxx um yep just to hold all this toys and stuff if you go in it probably gonna be one of those dog moms to like teach my dog to put his stuff back up too we can go through the toys in a second but look at this little mat. Got this from um, Marshalls. This one's from Marshalls. So cute. Says Wolf. Gonna use that for his food and drinks to put it right there so the floor won't be wet. This one is his bed for my room and for his little area um, for when I leave the house and I have to lock him up. Most of my apartment is carpeted. The dining room area and the hallway to my room and my bathroom are not carpeted, so that's why I'll keep him when I'm not home. Other than that, he'll have free reign of the house while I'm here. I got all these wipes because I know I'm going to be cleaning him as soon as we come in the house because I'll play that dirty stuff um, at all. So my dog will not be able to be on my bed. That's not that's not a thing that I'm going to do personally um, to each his own, but I know because he's gonna get big, I just prefer him not to be on my bed. So these are waste bags. Um, got these from Marshalls, um, as well as the wipes. Bees, calming shampoo. I don't know if he's gonna be scared of baths, but I thought this one was cute, smelled good, and yes, got this from Marshalls. Because of the type of dog that I'm getting, he will not shed, so I know I have to brush and comb him regularly. I'm gonna get the comb when I actually fill his hair, but I wanted to go ahead and get at least the brush. I did meet his mom, but I didn't get to meet his dad or even see what he looks like, so I'm not really sure. I don't know exactly how his coat is gonna end up coming out, so I wanted to wait until I kind of see him and see what type of hair he has to decide on which comb I got. But these little cute nail clippers I got from Marshalls, and this is waterless shampoo it is no harsh soaps no grays no toxins or parabens i'm i'm not like super super big on natural stuff but when i can i i try to go natural and organic um you know it's always better aloe vera and honey is how it smells so excited to spray that on him when he needs it so let's get into the toys that i bought him like i said um most of my shopping did happen at Marshalls or um, TJ Maxx and Home Goods. All of this was not the same day. I go there a lot in general, so every time I go, I'm probably picking up something else for him. This little frisbee I got from TJ Maxx. So cute, squishy, bendy, goes really far. I'm pretty sure that I got it because it says that it goes really far when we throw it for them. 
so definitely gonna have some fun with that. I got this little slow eating bowl. Slow them down when he's eating and gives him some brain stimulation. Next, I thought this was so cute. Little traveling water and food bowl. My main goal for everything was to get stuff that's going to be conducive when he gets bigger because he's not gonna stay small. I'll get him at eight weeks, so he's gonna get big super quick. And I wanted to make sure that most of the stuff I got for him wasn't for a little puppy. Um, so yeah, this one goes smaller for when he's small and he can't reach that far, and then goes deeper for when he's bigger and he can't reach further. And it closes up. It closes up and fits compact into whatever you want to put it in. Next, I got this leash from Home Goods. Super cute. Brand is Halo. Um, yeah, just a cute leash. I don't know why I chose that color. I might end up getting a blue one, quite honestly. Um, so TJ Maxx Home Goods have a lot of good toys. This is freaking Nerf brand, and I think it was only like five dollars, honestly. Um, but it's super cute. The like neck stretches. It throws really far. It has all these like places for him to tuck into stuff. Um, so here's a little ASMR. So allegedly they make them have this little crinkly sound to make them feel like they're crunching bones. That's a thing. Okay, so next. Got this little chewy thing. It keeps his breath smelling good. It's gonna help him with his teething because I'll definitely have him before he does that. Um, and then next, I know that I actually got this from Five Below and it's a little puppy training kit. It was super cute. Showing me how to teach him how to do tricks, like this is the basic stuff. Um, I've been watching dozens and dozens of YouTube videos trying to learn what I need to learn before he gets here, but I thought this would be cute and helpful. It came with a little clicker and um, this little toy to train him with. And now we're getting down to the good stuff, guys. This is gonna be his first day home collar. I did not wanna buy a harness yet because I don't know how big he is. I did meet him about three weeks ago now and he was still tiny. So when I finally get him, he's definitely gonna be at least double the size he was when I seen him. So I, I didn't wanna buy the harness until I actually have him in my hands and we'll go straight to the store, get the harness for him, we can size it there. But this collar was just too cute. Got this from Marshalls. I freaking love it so much. I know a lot of you have been waiting for this video because you guys want to know his name. You see my little SpongeBob socks if you know me. I love SpongeBob, always have, always will. My cousin last summer went to visit my grandma in Mississippi and she found a dog. Well, he found her <laughs> and she kept him. And now he's a part of our family too. We love him and his name is Patrick. So this is his little squeaky Patrick toy so he can get to know his big cousin real soon. And since we are some SpongeBob lovers around here, the name that I chose for my baby is Sandy Cheeks. And so I got this cute little name tag made on Pet Parade Boutique on Etsy. Um, it took about five days to get for me from the day I ordered it. I freaking love it, it's so cute. It has his name on the front and then my phone number on the back. I was able to choose SpongeBob print and I thought that was so cute and I'm so glad that that was even available out here in the universe. Felt like it was perfect for my little baby. And I got myself this cute little blanket. Couldn't tell you if I got it from Marshalls or TJ Maxx. I just know me and my best friend went to one of them last weekend and she calls her baby girl Bumblebee. And we seen this one next to a Bumblebee blanket and I just had to get it. I am number one dog mom. I cannot wait for you guys to actually meet him. I'm definitely gonna be doing a first day with my dog video for you guys. I'm so excited and I will see you guys in seven days.